finding professional journal articles from the Dwight Marvin Library for your EDUC 100 Child Development class. My name is Stephanie Ross. I'm a librarian at Hudson Valley Community College and the library liaison to the Early Childhood Education and Teacher Preparation Department. If you have questions about library research, you can always email me at s.ross at hvcc.edu. In this video, part one, I'll review keyword and search term selection and advanced search techniques. I'll also review the differences between professional journal articles and scholarly peer reviewed journal articles. When searching in library research databases, you'll need to use keywords or main concepts as your search terms. Let's take a look at one of the example topics that I found in your assignment packet. The topic is during the prenatal period, the mother's health and exercise. The first step will be to determine synonyms or related concepts because one author may use the term prenatal and another may say pregnancy. So it's a good idea to think about the terms that will be uh, most helpful for finding articles about your topic. We will connect these search terms using the Boolean operators AND and OR. When you use the Boolean operator AND, you'll get a much more focused set of results because your result list will contain both of these terms. For example, pregnancy and health. When you use the Boolean operator OR, this will expand your search. So you may find either of these terms, um, for example, fitness or exercise. Remember, OR means more. What are the main concepts or keywords for the topic friendships in the preschool age? Friendships and preschool. The first concept, friendships, um, other terms you may want to search are friends or peers or relationships, and this will help to expand your result list. I'll combine my concepts using the Boolean operator AND, and the second concept is preschool or kindergarten or early childhood. Another advanced search technique is truncation. This is when you use the asterisk at the end of the root of a term and the database will search various forms of that term. For example, infant with the asterisk at the end will search infancy, infant, or infants. For your research assignment, you will be looking for professional journal articles, also known as trade publications. These are written for a particular audience. These publications will contain news, current events information, and ads of interest to people in that particular industry. The focus is on practical information and current trends, as opposed to scholarly peer-reviewed journal articles. These contain original research and have been reviewed by a group of experts in the field. They often contain a methods or methodology section, original data, a literature review, and extensive references. Let's take a look at each of these types of articles. The first will be a scholarly peer-reviewed journal article. When I scroll through the text, you will notice that there are sections of this article, and they may be, um, for example, the methods section or um, a current study. It may also include a literature review. Here is some original data, more data. So this is an example of, of a scholarly peer-reviewed journal article, and this is what we are not looking for for this particular assignment. So now let's take a look at what we are looking for. This is an example of a professional journal article. When I scroll through the text of this article, you will see, for example, dialogue of an exchange between a teacher and her students, perhaps photographs, ideas for getting started, so this article is much more practical in nature. And this is an example of an article, a professional journal article, which is what you are looking for. In the next video, I'll review how to find professional journal articles for your research assignment.